Hey, how's it doing, guys? It's your boy Shaini YFM Shine, guys. I would like to tell my smash so a little subscribe to. Okay, so in this tutorial, guys, um, I'll show you how you're gonna install this Elgato Capture Card. Okay, 4K 60 Pro. Okay, guys. So as you can see, I had to remove the glass. Okay, as you can see, the glass is. Just fine over there, lying over there. Alright, so basically, uh, this is an RTX 4080. Alright, so it takes three lanes. But luckily, I do have an X16 lane right here where I could uh, easily put this thing. Alright, so yeah, let's do this. I can pull this lever back up just like that okay I guess and now I gotta screw this as you can see I'm gonna have to put a screw right here as you can see the screw screwed okay I right, guess so now for the cabling management guys for the HDMI input output so make sure that you have two HDMI cables at your disposal okay so I don't know if you're seeing this. This one it says on the HDMI cable. It says like uh, HDMI. As you can see, free port HDMI 4K, 2K. Right, so that means it supports 4K and then 2K as well. Right, that's that's great. Okay, so make sure that from your GPU. Okay, so we're gonna grab this from my GPU, guys. Um, from my GPU, I'm gonna connect one HDMI cable. Alright, I'm sorry about the mess of uh, like behind. There are a lot of cables. Alright, and the other end, okay. So one HDMI goes directly in my uh, graphic cards, okay, and the other end it will go into the Elgato input, okay, in the Elgato in. Let's do this. All right, and now from the Elgato out, you're gonna uh, plug another HDMI, and then it. Uh, that will go to your monitor okay I right, guys so as you saw it okay so from the Elgato out this one plugs and it goes into my monitor okay all right now we just have to Just have to pull the power. All right, so turning on my power supply. Oops, I forgot to install the glass lid. This thing, so I'm gonna get to that in a moment. Alright, so if you see a uh, black screen, okay, just give it a moment. It's going to find, as you can see, HDMI. Now I'm gonna log the in. Alright, and let me switch back on PC, okay? Alright, guys, so once your PC gets started, what you wanna do is you wanna just uh, open your browser and you want to search for this okay the capture card as you can see 4k 60 pro elgato so you want to visit elgato.com all right you want to go to downloads and here where it says select your product you want to scroll down as you can see 4k 60 pro all right and here it is 
all you have to do guys is to install the 4k capture utility all right so requires windows windows 10 6, uh, 64 bit or later okay or later that means even if you're on windows 11 you are good to go okay so i hit this download button right here and, and here what says find hardware drivers so you want to click here so i'm just gonna right click open it on a brand new uh window right here okay so yeah go ahead and click so when you click the download it will only download the 4k cap capture utility tool which is i've already installed it onto my desktop all right it's uh it's going to be like this elgato 4k capture card utility okay but for this capture card to work properly you need to install make sure that you you install the latest drivers as well here as you can see it says find hardware drivers so you, you want to click here or you want to right click as i did open link in a new tab and here as you can see the necessary drivers should be installed this is for windows 10 and windows 11 here all you have is to scroll down until you see your device your model name of your capture card mine is right here elgato game capture uh, 4k 60 pro so i'm gonna click here all right and i'm gonna start download i'm gonna hit this thing to open it all right so right now i'm currently installing the driver okay the program all right don't get confused this is a program guys a 4k capture utility is a program but you uh, for this to work properly you gotta find and install the drivers all right make sure that you install this driver as you can see it must show completed right here then click next and close all right so once you've done that now let's try to launch this elgato 4k capture uh capture utility and it should say one moment please uh if you notice any screen flickering don't worry about it all right changes and we are starting recording all right so you should see your your pc desktop right here so now guys see uh if you're on obs now let's see for obs you want to go to settings all right so as you can see right now if you try to yeah make sure that your base canvas is this and same goes for the output scale resolution all right don't downscale them all right so if you record on that software guys on this elgato 4k capture utility utility oh my god all right so if you're recording this there are some restriction all right so that's why we prefer we gotta use obs all right, so I'm going to quickly create a new scene. Just give me a second. Uh, monitor 1. All right, here I'm going to press Ctrl F. Or I can right click transform as you can see fit to screen, which is Ctrl F. All right. As you can see, it fit to the following screen. And to add um video capture card you, you want to add this video capture card you can rename this as uh, i don't know 4k 60 pro or maybe capture card all right and then it's going to pick up the game capture card 4k pro mk2 blah blah, blah. okay it's going here make sure that the device it's like your uh elgato capture card right and we also have elgato screen link as well i'm gonna get into another video about that and you can do it now if you have a uh, output custom audio you can use that use to capture custom audio via like um right now i have my microphone all right so as you can see now it's two layered two layers okay and here's a capture card so basically it's the same screen i hope this makes sense all right but the name of the capture card is elgato 4k 60 all right don't expect uh 4k 120 or 4k 100 uh, 144 hertz of course you're gonna get if you play 4k all right so basically you'll have to 
change your display blah 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 where is it nope not here so yeah uh you'll have to swap your display to as you can see what says recommended set it to this but your hertz guys your uh, refresh rate you will be limited with 60 it will capture 4k now but you're gonna get 60 hertz okay so thanks so much for watching guys